mayor spoke exclusively to us this evening. He tells us there there are eight gun shops in the city of Carson, and if this resolution passes, they would either have to shut down or move to another city. A near outright gun ban. It's what Mayor Albert Robles wants for the city of Carson. On Tuesday, he's presenting a resolution for a radical plan to limit gun sales and gun possession. Technically, legally can't ban gun dealers in the city. We can regulate where they cannot be, and we're saying we don't want them in Carson. Robles' plan involves the city's land use powers. Gun sales and gun possession would not be allowed within a one mile radius of a school, park, church, or a daycare, making it impossible for anyone to be in the city limits with a gun. The only exception is having a gun inside your home. If the true purpose of owning a gun is to protect your home and your family, then that's where your gun belongs, is in your home. Even with that exception, Loyola Law Professor Jessica Levinson says it's not likely to hold up in court. This strikes me as a resolution that just is too broad. Even if you want to use land use, you still have to contend with the fact that the Second Amendment is an individual right. The right to bear arms is something that the Supreme Court has said, again, every individual has. If the city council passes the resolution and it's deemed constitutional, the eight stores currently in the city limits would have to leave but be given reasonable notice. Mayor Robles says his motive behind the resolution, mass shootings. To propose something like this after a mass killing is too late. And I don't want it to weigh on my conscience that we could have done something sooner rather than after the fact. Mark and Michelle, this resolution will be heard in front of the city council tomorrow right here at City Hall starting at 6 o'clock. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Click the ABC7 logo to subscribe to our Eyewitness News YouTube channel.